Hi, I'm Kevin Dandy, and I'm a board-certified physical therapist. I'm Purvi, and I'm also a board-certified physical therapist. We are here today to go through some exercises that you will be doing either after your surgery or some exercises that you can do to try to avoid surgery. This is meant to supplement your program under the care of your physician and or physical therapist. It's important to define a few terms that you'll see in these videos. Generally after surgery, you'll be first starting with passive range of motion. With passive range of motion, the involved limb is doing none of the movement. It'll solely be performed by a physical therapist in a range that is pain-free and without any muscle guarding by the patient. Once you progress from passive range of motion, the next step will be active assisted range of motion. In this scenario, the involved limb is allowed to move some, but the majority of the movement is being provided by the uninvolved limb. Once you progress past that, you've then gotten to the active range of motion phase where the involved limb is doing all of the motion.